Today I made a huge tech fail and wasted so much time. We had just finished building this PC and the CPU light came on in the motherboard. The PC wasn't posting, so I tried a couple things. Usually when we get this debug light, the first thing I want to do is check all the connections and make sure everything is properly secure. Once we eliminated that, the next thing I wanted to do is reseat the CPU. I reseated it and it still didn't boot. I also swapped it for a brand new Ryzen processor. Same issue. Now here's where I went wrong. My assumption is at this point, the CPU light is on, I've swapped out the CPU, I've tried switching out the RAM, I've tried a couple other the things. The only thing seems to be wrong is the motherboard. I've had experiences with these motherboards in the past and I've had to RMA quite a few. I said, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and swap the motherboard and I did. Before I put the new motherboard in the case, I wanted to make sure it was working outside first before I do any extra work. Everything seemed great, it posted. I plug everything back into the case, I make sure everything is screwed in, I cable manage it and everything. I go to turn it back on and it's still having the same debug light. I just made sure it was working, so what's going on? I'm pretty frustrated at this point and the only thing I didn't try is the power supply. Plugged a new one in and it worked. Lesson learned, try every part before swapping the motherboard.